my favorite real life supervillain is uh, is Richard Branson. Richard Branson, the guy that runs all the Virgin stuff, and he's what I think a supervillain would actually be because like he does a bunch of stuff doesn't make any sense. He's always smiling because it doesn't matter if it goes well or fails. He's still on top of the world and doing a weird laugh. And he, like, read his, read his autobiography sometime, Losing My Virginity. It's like, okay, I started a record label and that failed. So you know what I did? I started a record label with the exact same name. And when that didn't go well, do you know what I did? I started an airline. It's just like, oh, I, I didn't know how to alphabetize records. Trust me with your lives. Like, trust this. Uh, the very first song the label ever acquired was Tubular Bells, the theme song to The Exorcist. He has a supervillain theme song. How are we not talking about this? And his latest thing is that he's paying out of pocket for us to have a company that mines asteroids in space. That's the most Lex Luthor shit I've ever heard of. Like it's, how does he even keep a straight face in the press conference? Like, what are we mining for? Oh, the, the element that will allow me to defeat Superman once and for all. I, I thought that was obvious. Why else would I be? <laughs> I'm just, I'm just kidding. But his meddling will end. <laughs> well, I'm off to water ski with nude supermodels. How's your day? <laughs> Branson. 